Oh my James, you'll never believe what's coming. Oh, the Great Western Road, original film footage from 1921 at Glasgow's swankiest boulevard. Oh, imagine the delights of the banter, frozen in celluloid. Oh, absolutely. Oh, wait, I'm sorry, we can't go. Has it been and went? No, but the picture house is in Edinburgh. Oh, <laughs> yuck. Edina, Scotia's midden seat. Capital in name only. One great big dirty wet blanket of a place, full of tacky rock shops and saunas pumping hondrily. Ah, those Edinburghians are all doing aloof and superior by no half as friendly as your Glasgow Keely. Oh, they're absolute head the balls. <laughs> we'll not be travelling through there. Indeed, we will not be going through there, Gary. As the banter puts it, you'll have more fun at a Glasgow stabbing than an Edinburgh wedding. <laughs> too true, James. Too true. Oh, driver. How do you think that Scottish Parliament's getting on? Right, now, what else, you? Had on 50 mile on our budget. <laughs> See these MSPs, I don't know what they're talking about. It's a load of Barry, so it is. Barry? Barry White, shite! <laughs> what about it? Here, listen. What do you think Scotland will do in the fit for that's coming up the new? Oh, I had the other bastards. And the letters been that they've done another year since 19 canteen. You yeah, mind you that, I'm a toy, sorry. Eh? He's born a Clyde, I'm going to give you a salmon. That's Ruby's that boy, so you think. Yeah, see that question of sport? See that Sue Barker? She would suck her face off him if she got a minute, so she would. Here, pull in, that'll do us. All right. There you are, my friends. That's uh, 43 pounds. Hold on a minute. Just know where you get in. I know. Here, there's a hundred. Don't get changed, you a hundred. Oh, hang the chains. We're only paying for the banter. We do love it. We genuine Rennie Macintosh tea strainer, if you will. Oh, Gary, it's an utter dully and totally tosh. Oh, well, may we, James, and I trust you'll be coming round for your tea in the Glasky style. Does the Pope wear a mitre? <laughs> now, tell me, Gary, where'd you pick it up at some little antiques fair? Indeed, I did not, James. I picked it up doing the barrels. Oh, the barrels. Well, it was tagged at 90 pounds, but I managed to haggle the stall holder down to 85. Well, that's the beauty of the battles. And he threw in an anthology of Robbie Burns' love poetry. Oh, I love Robbie Burns. I thought, murder policeman, what a bargain. Oh, and the stall holder, a real boy. Came out. A Glasgow ticket. Absolutely full of the banter. In fact, as he wrapped him, he looked me straight in the eye and said, I saw you coming. Oh, the Glasgow banter doing the battles. Oh, James, I'm sorry I'm late. Oh, Gary, at last. I'm sitting in all of my Jack Jones and thought you were giving me a pure rubber diggy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you dance at what I was running. I hit myself. Had to get a track, sir. <gasps> a Joseph K. Baxi. Oh, the very same. What a hoot. Oh, and the taxi driver. Well, what a Glasky man. A Glasgow Jimmy. Full of the banter. Non-stop. Sitting in the back there, I could hardly make a word do it. But the ebb and flow of his phrasing was absolutely delightful. Ah, well, that's your taxi patter for you. Aye. Well, the general thrust of it was fit bar, the Rangers and the Celtic. Ah, the Glasgow fit bar, eh? The Blues versus the Greens. Tell me, Gary, which was he? A dandy Ranger or a battling Celtic? Well, James, that I couldn't tell, but he was very, very nice indeed. At one point, he called me his honey. No. Oh, I tried to tip him, but he just threw it back and said, keep it hum. Ah, the famous taxi banter of the Glasgow Jimmy.